Here's a neat little about us or about me section for a person like a coach, for example. Uh, we've got some colors and some read more, which is happening over here, which you can then click through uh, if you have a link on it and then the image with the purple line going through. How do we change this? Let's go and have a squiz. So text our story. Of course, you can change that to um, my story. Let's just do that as an example. And let's go to design. We're looking for any colors that we might want to change. And let's see, uh, nothing there. So, so a quick preview. No, nope. my story. Okay, so that's the bit that's changed. Then we're going to look at this one about us. Let's click that away and save. <clears throat> Let's see the divider. And there we go. We've got a purple color here. I'm just going to go with a green. If you've been watching the videos, you're probably quite familiar with this green already. I'm just trying to keep it simple. Let's go to advanced like we normally do. You always want to check on that. Uh, and let's do a quick preview. There we go. That's a little divider there. And then we can save and exit. So let's continue further. This is the call to action, our mission. So this would then be my mission. And then the text, which is going to be added. Then let's go to design. We're looking here for any colors that we want to change. Here we go. We want to change that one. And we'll leave the body text the same. Let's go to advanced. See if we can find anything here. Nothing that requires changing. Let's have a quick preview. Here we go. All right. Save and exit. And then we'll do the same over here. Go to design and change the color. Yep. And then quickly go through a bit further. Nothing there of note. Next will be the image. This image is 338 by 338. Let's open that and have a look. You can see it's got a, a clear background here. You will need to test and see what it looks like with a square image. Uh, if it doesn't work that well for you, then you're going to need to open the PSD and create a rounded image to fit into that space. Make sure to keep it the same size. Let's see what else we've got. Nothing further there. And this is where we have that background let's have a look once more this purple line over here is that color over there i recognize it from before we're gonna make it a dark green just so it suits with the rest and then let's keep scrolling have we got anything else here nothing so now we can preview it there we go you can see the colors changed save and exit and then these are the two buttons that we reviewed on the side there. It's a hash link at the moment, so you're just gonna add your button link in there. And then you can change the text. So this is gonna be read about me. And then we probably wanna change the color. Here we go. Oops. Right, and then there's a background color as well. You can change those things. Here's the hover effect. Uh, let's just do that. What in this case is white. Uh, we'll just leave that. You can play around with those and get them exactly the way that you want. What else is here? Not much. So let's click save. Let's go and change the other button quickly as a last step. There we go. And we'll just leave it at that so let's click save let's click update and then we can go and review the page and everything should be updated there we go as you can see here all the green right through 
and of course you can change the image if you want. So that's how you do this module. Thanks for watching.